Model railroad operations. Often we feel confused and intimidated about the subject. Quite frequently, the information of an operating layout is elaborated and we feel like it is hidden deep behind of a dark tight zipper, hard to access and grasp firmly. When we go through the thought process of model train operations, we have to think about our miniature size object first. It is always resided the inside of a compressed and confined space. It also built on top of the saggy unstable circular thoughts called spheres of doubt and fear, and we struggle to find the exit when we need to release our very necessary golden fluidity desire of operating sessions. Furthermore, when we think about the operations, we experience itchiness on two spheres, the doubt and fear, and we vigorously scratch them, so that we end up forgetting about playing with the actual equipment. Sometimes, in worst case, we even experience a bad smell of hopelessness. Naturally, we want to play with our miniature object all the time, and want to stretch it with our imaginations. Also, we want our miniature equipment to be longer and stronger. The danger of this thought is 99% of us, except a fellow model railroader Mr. Jeremy, are embarrassed our excessively short miniature equipment and easily discouraged about playing with the item. But, on the contrary, the history of model railroad operations proof the opposite. The technique of operations is the most important, not the length of our miniature equipment and you will be able to overcome problem of our always short length miniature equipment. How can you open the window to easy cool breeze and how allow it to stretch freely? And how can we have enough room for the flexibilities of joys? This short and simple yet powerful and straightforward instruction video will clear out all of your concerns and lead you to the ultimate enjoyment with confidence. Also, this video is designed for the total beginners and experienced seasoned master modelers. For the beginners, it will show you exactly what to do on operating sessions. For expert modelers, you can experience a whole new level of powerful excitement and unleashing forbidden sensation of wild joy from this instruction. The instruction is comprised from three crucial scenes. The first scene is what you must to do when you commence an operating session. The second scene is how you can build confidence about your layout and establishing feeling of your pike is absolutely the best in the world, without worrying about somebody else's popular established layouts. And the last scene is how you can elevate your operating skill to the maximum level and feeling total freedom, powerful joys and excitements of the model railroad operating sessions. Ladies and gentlemen, now to the main instruction.